The class was uh, T775, uh, Museums and Performance, and it was looking at how theater is used in museums, how museums use theater as part of their mission, and also how theater artists can learn from the objects in a museum. The main project in the class was the students co-curated an exhibit on Indonesian puppetry, and I was really interested in how we could bring theater into the museum exhibits. Using students from different disciplines and coming from different viewpoints and also different countries uh, was very interesting, especially when you're doing something like culture and especially where you're doing a collaboration between two different sort of uh, disciplines with theater or performance studies and museum, museum studies um, together. We had undergrads in the class, we had MFA um, costumers in the class. We had PhD students, we had MA students in theater, theater PhD and theater MA students. So I really wanted the students to find a way to bridge and, and talk to the audience about how it's a performance and show the performative parts of it and um, how the puppets are made and to really give the audience a real taste of Indonesia and puppets. I think getting the idea of practice as research is really important to me, especially in theater and and because you have the chance to not only read about it and study about it, but then do it. So when you do it, you learn a lot more than, you know, I could read about something for seven months, but then they're like, okay, set up an exhibit now. And I'm like, uh, what am I gonna do? So that was a really interesting part was mixing practice and theory. Now, scholars and artists within a department are always working together and, and theater is by nature a collaborative art form but I think having different perspectives and different ideas being brought to a project or into a classroom makes the classroom just so much more interesting and exciting.